right guys it's been a while since we've done this man it's been two weeks because we've been building such an epic build for you so two weeks of work in i don't know 10 to 15 minutes or look at this entrance isn't it beautiful right we got a totally like just free stand in front which just took so long that was uh my mate, Mr. Potato Wayne, that did that. I managed to get this whole back of the building done. By the time he's done the front. We've got the parking spots. Look at this. Actual parking spots. We've got valet parking for the guests that come. This is a ski resort slash hotel. It's got a fully built gym in there. It's got a restaurant. It's got an indoor pool. It's got an indoor pool with under the floor lighting. It is actually amazing. So we're going to admire the front. We're going to head through. The double front doors here, which we actually got on. Which is amazing. So, double front door to entrance. Let's open it up and go in. Look at this place inside. Honestly, what the hell. It's beautiful, man. So, as soon as you come in, we're going to rock and roll to the left here. So, we've got all the planters growing. We've got like the fire pits there, the communal fire pits left and right. And quite a big open space at the front. It's a very fancy pants building. And what you do is when you come in, you go into the reception. And this is where you would book your lodges, your room, your um, which way you want to go. Snowboarding, uh, skiing, you know, whichever outdoor sports you want to do. We've got this is just the main building. We have a whole plethora of things to build outside. So, walking through the reception, you're into the kitchen. And we see we got the fish, we got all the foods. We got a grill there. So, yep, we lobbed a bed over the top of a fire and we called it a grill. Because why not? Uh, you got to get pretty creative with these builds as you've only got logs to work with. So, we do what we can. We've got all the food. The kitchen is fully stocked. And if you come into like the utility room next to the kitchen, we've done the sinks. So, fully functioning working sinks there. And then we've got like the dinner plates and the towels, things like that. Uh, the same on the shelf there, you know, just cloths, towels, things like that to help clean and things like that. Utility room. Um, so going through, this is where the kitchen would go straight through to the restaurant. So let's have a look. Let's go through the front door. Restaurant, baby. You've got your two long tables for big families and stuff. And then you've got your private little booths here just in case... Virginia fancies a little date. Let's make it a bit more cozy in here, shall we? There you go. Get the fire on, look. Happy days. Right, yeah. So we've got the little bar. We've got Dave here. He's your barkeep. So Dave will get you a vodka and, uh, I don't know, energy drink, I suppose, if that's what you're into. And then, again, more booths. So booths going all the way around the outside. This one's got a romantic candle if you want to like that as well. And then looking up, we've got the rope design. We've got the sort of statues going in up there. Have a nice glow behind them with some chandeliers as well. So that is looking pretty cool, guys. Let's go over to the indoor pool, right? Indoor pool. So we managed to get under the floor lighting. There's a whole separate video on that if you want to check it out. So we just made the lake disappear. And then we wired it up underneath and put the bulbs in, basically. Well, yeah, that is a pool. That is like the jacuzzi thing in this side of the pool there. And we have changing rooms as well. So you got your male and your female. And there you go. We know it's iced over, everyone. It's just for looks. Okay. <laughs> so heading up the stairs now. Oh, the sun's going to come out as well. So you're going to see it in daytime as well in a minute. So coming up to this, we've got the fancy pants stairs. The fancy pants railings look looking pretty good. We've got a left or a right. If we go woodish left, we've got a fat balcony there. Looking pretty cool. Just a nice uh, spot to kick back and enjoy the views. You do get a pretty good view out of there. The big open front. Right, this is the gym. So, coming into the gym, we're going to see what you can tell. Uh, if you can see what they are. So, this is... Like the lap pull down machine, you know, the, the bars that you'd get, you'd sit and you'd pull it down to your chest. Uh, this is indeed a treadmill. Yeah, that's right. We've got a treadmill. I'm sure if you take your shoes off and put your socks on, 
you can uh, get a pretty good sweat on that. This is the, the tricep dip. So that's where you would do your dips, build those uh, triceps. Triceps take up two thirds of your arms. So you build them, you get our big arms, bro. Right, we got we got the chest there. Uh, here we got the bench, the bench press there. So you lay down obviously, and then, you know, it's racked at the minute. There's no weights on it at the minute. We got the incline bench there. We've got a couple of snacks and stuff. We've got the medicine ball. We've got the weights. We've got the barbell stand. And, of course, we've got your anabolic steroid, uh, profin and, you know, drinks and things like that. And then we've obviously got the speed ball. B -b 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 speed bag. Oh, I missed the rope as well. This keep you fit, this will. Look at this. 100 reps of that. I tell you. Nightmare. I don't know, put the ball there, that's a pretty bad idea. Um, also, we've got the UFC man. So you'd come in, you're like, kick, jab, 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 hook, hook. You know? So pretty good. So gym there. Keep you fit. Membership's pretty cheap. Uh, going across the road from the gym, this ambiance is amazing. So we actually have a... Uh, <laughs> the bartender is working today. So we have a fully stocked bar. We've got the vodka and coke and stuff like that there. So, here we go. He's going to love me a drink, look. <laughs> what we got? Oh, we got a juice. Let's go. All right, let's not be rude. There we go. You want me scrummy? <laughs> right, cheers, barkeep. All right, we've got a seating area there. Bench there. we got the uh, the chandeliers. So, we haven't got really a lot of electricity in here. There's another grill there so you can sit and have your food, you know. Uh, a couple of statues and things like that. Looks absolutely cool. The setting in here, the mood with just the orange is absolutely great. Got a planter up there. Yeah, pretty cool place to come and have a chill. So if you want to keep fit, opposite end. If you want to get drunk, <laughs> this end or chill and have a drink after a day of the slopes. Uh, coming up here, this is the floor where you can stay. Book a room, put your feet up, have a sleep, whatever you want. There's a bed, bookshelves, benches, whatever you need. Um, just a bit of comfort in there. You know, you got your, your little private toilets and things like that in there as well. Um, so, yeah, you can come in here. Book the rooms. There's four rooms on each side. So, but this is the main place. This is like a bit of a spa room and things like that. And this will be the most expensive. So, just showing you the rooms here. Desks, you know, just your basic needs. If you want any food, you go down to the restaurant. If you want a drink, you go into the bar, etc. You've got your double beds there with your side uh, things. A couple of bits and bobs on the on the shelf there. Another double bed with some other bits like that. So that is the bedrooms. Looking pretty good. Getting on to the top floor now. Now, just the atmosphere in it is so cool. you got a little design at the front there. But this is the best view of the house. You get the whole front. Look at that out there best view especially in the day so you got your planters there just a bit of nice decoration and then you got up here as well this is just a balcony slash seating area if you want to go up there depends how full it is these little fancy diagonal planks now moving over again we've got exactly the same design on this side looking pretty epic let me know in the comments guys what you think to this build this is a fully stocked bar restaurant gym ski resort reception kitchen anything you need fancy stairs this place is looking absolutely sick it took us so long to build and thinking of ideas like the gym we was like what can we do for the gym and then we was in there and it was great we were just bouncing ideas off each other i was like yes let's do that so, you know, reception areas, pools. Man, I think this is cool. Given the fact that um, it's quite early build, the game at the minute, and you've literally just got logs and creativity. And we have lots of creative creativity. Look at the, uh, the parking spots even. Look at this place at night. Looks absolutely awesome. So, yeah, there you go, guys. That is the ski resort build. Thank you very much for watching. Please drop this video a like. It really helps with the algorithm. Help get this video out there because these builds take ages. If you've seen any of my builds before, you do know that this take us quite a while. It's usually me and Mr. Potato Aim, aka Atkin. We do it all. So 
yeah it's amazing any suggestions what we can build in the comments below like the video subscribe if you want to see more hit the bell because these come out quite a lot actually we release these quite a lot so and they're doing pretty well we built submarines uh pirate ships uh pyramids lighthouses sea fortresses mansions anything like the ideas just keep on coming but this is just to start the ski resort we have all this lake to build on and i still might wall off the whole of the outside and we're going to have a park in here we're going to have places to stay we're going to have log cabins it's going to be absolutely full of activities as well and then we're going to have zip lines to the slope and all that stuff so stay tuned for all that stuff guys thanks for watching and i'll catch you in the next one peace I think the girls with their nails done now.